Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. What do you see, Memphis? Let's look at exactly what Memphis is looking at. What do you see, huh? You see the geese? You see them? Did they just fly in and land over there? <laughs> the one downside to where we're camping right now is the geese poop. Yeah, we're between two lakes. Yep. Three, kind of. Yeah, and swamps and... Yeah, yeah, we're surrounded by a lot of water. Wait a minute. What? Shouldn't they be leaving anyway? They should be, well, these are probably Canadian geese, so... They still fly south for the winter. Yeah, but they're further north, they're oh. stopping. Oh, they were in get, Canada? Yeah, you get it now. You I get, get it now. now. Yeah, yeah, I get it. I get it. <laughs> honk, honk, honk. <laughs> uh. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, look at them all. They're filling up, that one's huge. They're filling up on food. Memphis just thinks they're the greatest thing in the world. This is the greatest TV ever. I can watch these geese. I got to chase them earlier. It's the greatest thing ever. <laughs> I know. He wake you up this morning yeah, too? Yeah, I see him on top of that dead tree. He's just laughing uh, at him. Oh yeah, there he is. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> uh, so, when was that, May? Was it May? A couple so. months ago, I think it was May. It might have been, been June. It might have been June. Um, we went camping with the Chicks Life. If you don't know who they are, they have a YouTube channel. I'll link it up above and down below. Anyway, we went camping here with Chicks Life, with James and Ashley, and Goose and Maverick. And anyway, when they left, they let us know that they lost their drone. And they're like, oh, if you go back up there, if it's still there, well, it's... They didn't... They didn't really lose it. They, yeah, they know where it is. They know where it's at. And now we do too. They told us where it was at. Yeah. So we uh, looked for it today. I'm thinking, gosh, it's September. There's no way it's still stuck up in that tree. Sure enough. Yeah. You'll have to. It's over here. You'll have to show them that footage. Yep. I'll show you where it's at. Because uh, I don't even think you can see it here. Oh, you can't, can you see it from it here? It is. Where's my finger? It is right there see if somewhere. You can zoom in. Memphis is like, pay attention There's to There's branches me. that make a Y like that. There it is. See it? Right there. there. <laughs> so we're going to attempt a drone rescue later. Yep. It's going to be a drone by drone rescue. Drone right? by drone rescue. And if you lose my drone, I'm going to be upset. No, I think I think we got a good idea. We're going we're gonna to tie the fishing string to the bottom of the drone. And as the drone takes off, we're going to keep the line nice and tight. So right. that because we noticed with Mike, he tried uh, tying something to his drone and it lifted the string yeah. right yep. up into the quadcopter. So, so we don't want it. that. No, nope, we don't want that. So we're gonna keep it nice and tight and we're gonna fly the quadcopter over the tree and then land it on the other side so that hopefully the string lays on top That's of what we're the hoping. branch. And then we're gonna take the fishing line and we're gonna tie a different string to it. A better it, string. A better string and then pull the better string over to it and hopefully break the branch out. So that will be later though because it's super, it's windy. super windy. I hope the wind does cut down so we can actually attempt this. But if Well, it stays we have this tomorrow windy, too, so. If it stays this windy, I might just tie a rock to this. And, and see. start throwing. Start throwing, yep. So later on today, we might have to try some drone rescue. What? You can't be friends with everybody at the park. I saw that dog. I know. Think of all the windstorms we've had and it's still there. Well, you guys probably couldn't really see, but the propeller of the quadcopter sticks up like this and it's just yeah. like that i mean it's just, just yeah it's not yeah. even the leg it's nope, the propeller it's not even the leg it's the prop and, and it's stuck between two branches so we're gonna see what we can do i can't believe it's still up there though. so james and ashley if you're watching we're gonna attempt a drone recovery later on today <laughs> the other thing we'll possibly be doing later on today we boost awesome 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 company sent us a connect rv65 so what this is going to do is this is going to boost our cell phone service out here and hopefully make it so we actually have internet for yeah. our cell phones yeah, a, lot of, a lot of people uh if you live out in the country or whatever might already be familiar with this because uh if you're in the in the country in the sticks or whatever you can get these for your house too right just to help boost that phone service on your on your cell phone so we got it for out here because we come here a lot and Let's see, it says I have 3G on my phone, but I really don't. Nothing actually loads. And then I have absolutely no service to text anybody or anything. Let's see. You said oh. you... Yeah, I was going to say, <laughs> it went away, but 
it came right back. So, so. it's kind of there. So this should it, actually help. It, it could be from the, the, what is it? The ranger station that's kind of boosting Maybe. it right now. I don't know, but we're going to set this up later. We're going to head into Marquette right now because it's our wedding anniversary and we're going to spend the day in Marquette, but then we're going to come back and set all this stuff up. We have a lot of stuff going on today. We'll be busy. Happy anniversary. Hey, thanks. <laughs> uh, all right. So we'll set this up later. WeBoost also makes systems like this for your car. They make them for your house. So I will put some links to their website down below. And again, this video is sponsored by them. They sent us this to test out. So if you want to go check out what they have, I really want the car one now because when we drive up here, there's like no service and for most of the way up here. I think what's funny is, I mean, it's it's we boost, it's right? W E boost. You know, it sounds like hey, we boost, right? You know? But then I realized it's Wilson Electronics. Oh, that's funny. But it is funny. That is funny. Creative name. Creative name. I'm like, <laughs> I, even if their last name isn't Wilson, that was smart thinking. Yeah, it was. <laughs> but I'm sure Wilson Electronics have been making electronics for probably years now. Probably. Well, I'm excited to try this out, but uh, we're going to go on some adventures first. So I don't know if we, did we actually tell them where we're going to market? I don't think we did. Yeah, so, right. because it's our anniversary and we're up here camping, we thought, since everybody else that's coming isn't going to be up here till later tonight, look at this view. I know, right? Um, Jamie and I are driving to Marquette, which is like two hours from the campground, not too bad. We're gonna have to come back in a couple weeks because this will be beautiful yeah. for fall colors. Yeah, this will be really nice for fall colors. Hey look, there's a waterfall up here. Oh yeah, there's there's a waterfall up here. <laughs> <laughs> Alger Falls is on the side of the road. Yes. But anyway, we thought we'd load up and head out to Marquette for the day and right. go see some stuff and not get pulled over by that police officer right, right. there as we come flying down the hill. <laughs> Oh, my ears popped. Did your ears yeah, pop? My ears. Hey, look, they're checking out the waterfall. Yeah. Ready? Sweet. Don't blink. You might miss it. There it is. <laughs> anyway, we're in Munising right now. We're heading to Marquette. So we stopped to let the dogs out at Bay Furnace. We're going to go see a blast furnace where iron was made from 1870 to 1877. I know. We're out of the car. What more do you want? <laughs> so this is Bay Furnace. Well, the remains of it. That's how they used to make pig irons and this is pretty much all that's left of it look at it on the other side so the sun ain't shining yeah. right in our eyeball memphis is like no we need to go forever <laughs> and it's right here out on the water lake superior yep. oh i bet there's rocks down there jamie yeah. <laughs> oh there is look how many rocks are down here mm -hmm. let's get distracted oh wait we got to show them so there is what is remaining of Bay Furnace. Yeah, let's go down here. Whoa, what are those big blue berries that aren't blueberries? Uh, Whoa, be careful, it's slippery. Okay. Yay, water! <laughs> Yay! Shelby's like, take me swimming! She wants to go further. Oh, I gave you her short leash. We should have grabbed her long one. She's like, I'm thinking about it. Yeah. Thinking about it. Yeah. <laughs> She's thinking about it. Are you gonna go swimming, Shelby? She's like, I don't know, guys. This water is way colder than you think. Mm -hmm. Way yeah, colder. I've got my legs cold. Yeah, it's it's Lake Superior. It's, nice agates. it's mm -hmm. never warm. Oh yeah, we could look for agates. There's a red tree. Jamie's over there picking rocks. And this is Munising Bay. I think that's Grand Island right there, where we saw the Grand Island ice caves years ago. Yeah, that is. That's Grand Island right there. What a gorgeous, gorgeous day. And a red tree. So we made it to Marquette. And remember the ore dock we showed you guys back in winter? Well, this is another ore dock that I didn't even know they had. And I think they still use this one. Because there's like a yeah, big it's definitely an facility. Yeah, there's train cars on top of it. They still use it. <laughs> That's so cool. We need to see it like in use. Yeah. We're taking the scenic road. We don't really know where we're going. We're trying to find a spot we saw online, but <laughs> this is an added bonus to see this ore dock. Yeah. Check out how cool that is. So Definitely they must train. load the rocks from the train cars and then they like... They dump them onto the boats. And then it slides down those big chutes. 
Are there any boats in there? There's a boat. There's a boat. Nope, none of the none of the shoots dangling out. No, nope, but there's a big ship right there that they're loading up. Uh -huh. Oh, and a train. <laughs> and a caboose. Uh, a caboose. Like oh, we, we can see there. We can see the ship. Like we found a park. Hey, we this found is, another park. All right. Oh well, we okay. No dogs permitted in park. Oh, okay. Well, we're leaving. See you later. Bye. So we figured out that this is the park we're supposed to be at, and we also figured out that they probably don't allow dogs because it's sheer cliffs. Yeah, we're at, what, 35, 40 foot cliffs? At least. Yeah, you can see where the, you see the blue? It's a, sh a straight drop. Yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll show you here. Yeah, we're gonna come out here and see what we can see, but we'll, we'll the dogs let Jess, have to... Yeah, we'll let Jess get out of the car and she'll get some video. Yeah, the dogs have to stay in the car. I know, Shelby, you're not happy about it. <laughs> so this is the Black Rocks, and this is where people apparently go and jump off rocks. The dogs are not allowed out of the car, so they're gonna sit in here with Jamie. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah. I'm gonna go see if I can see some people jumping off some rocks. So this is definitely a pretty cool area. Lots of people not, not reading instructions and bringing their dogs out here even though they're not supposed to be here. Look at how cool this is. Oh. That's pretty wicked. I'm gonna walk over here real quick. So that's where people are jumping off at. Going. Okay. Okay, what well, got just wait. Just tell us when. They're okay. going right They're now. Going. I got it. Three, okay. Okay. okay, she's got it. Three, two, one. Ah! <laughs> it's warm. It's warm, yeah, right. <laughs> All right, we caught some people jumping off the cliff. What, are you watching? what do you think, Memphis? You watching mm -hmm. people? Yeah. While I was gone, actually that lady down there in the blue gave Jamie a pepper. Did she say what kind of pepper it was? No, but it appears to be like a yellow pepper. She just randomly gave you a pepper. Mm-hmm. I told her I put it with my eggs tomorrow. All right, that means so I have to get she, eggs, got yeah, it. She, I asked her if she grew them and she said yes. Oh, well, and, uh, She hey. has a lot of them. Oh, well she's down there. Yep. I can still hear people jumping. Oh yeah, I keep hearing them. <laughs> Three, two, one. It's <laughs> high. It's scary looking. But yeah, oh yeah, if you gotta count it down, yeah. you gotta get a little bit of courage to make that jump. Sorry, my fist can't go back there. There was some people with dogs back yeah, there and it was that. scary. Yeah, I bet. So anyway, let's continue on. Yep. Oh my goodness. Holy mackerel. I guess I did I didn't forgot to get veggies on yours. You did, didn't you? I did. I was sorry. It's alright. I'm a little off. <laughs> it's a little hot. But it looks good. Mm -hmm. What'd you get? I got a club sandwich with pickles mm. and cucumbers on it. Uh -huh. Instead of lettuce, because I can't have lettuce. We went to Togo's, which is here in Marquette, and it's Marquette Originals. There's two of them here in Marquette, but I guess there's only there's the only two. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of like the deli. So mm -hmm. we figured we'd try it for our, it's kind of like, it's like, look out Shelby. It's like our anniversary dinner slash lunch. Right. Is it good? It's good. Good. I'm gonna eat mine now. Mm -hmm. I'm hungry. I'm <laughs> Well, we made it back to camp a little bit later than we thought, so I don't know if we're gonna do drone rescue tonight. The girls are over here enjoying some dinner. Is that what you've been waiting all day for? You had lunch in the car. You really did. <laughs> now they're gonna enjoy some dinner. Matt and Greg apparently are on the way up, but they won't be here till way later, so. They'll show up when they show up. It's a nice big pole you got there. Yeah, you like that? You like that? <laughs> Careful with your pole. Right? <laughs> uh, so Jamie's gonna figure out how to put this thing on the camper apparently. It really matters what side. I don't think it really does either. It'll be interesting. Operation Rescue the Drone will be waiting until daylight. Because it's dark. We're not going to try to get it out of the tree while it's dark. Who do you hear, Shelby? Shelby, who's here? Who do you hear? Who do you hear, huh? 
Do you hear him talking? You better get over here. She's going nuts. It's frog. Oh, ribbit. Yeah, here, watch your ankles. You better get over here, Greg. I'm coming. 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 All right, should we get natural reactions from these guys? Sure, let's get natural reactions from these guys. Oh, with the rocks? Yeah, I mean, oh, okay. you already saw the picture, but... Whoa! Isn't that awesome? Let me, let me see the rock. Before you... <laughs> He's like, I gotta see this I gotta before see you do it. Okay. Before I do this, okay. thing, yeah. Holy crap! <laughs> Wait, wait, hang on, let me back up. <laughs> <laughs> My shoes and clothes are all... Isn't I that took a highlighter and just went down. That's awesome. Yeah. Isn't yeah. that crazy? Yeah. Wow! <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, the double oh, look at Memphis. <laughs> Memphis is like, I'm in the puddle. Look at her face. She's like, I didn't know we had friends coming. <laughs> oh, I oh, thank you. Welcome to camping, Matt. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Well, I have been welcomed. The dog's made out with me. You know, it's like, here you go. Welcome to camp life. Yep. I'm scratching a butt already. <laughs> yeah. So we got our WeBoost system set up. We didn't attach it to the wall yet because we want to make sure that it works before we attach, attach everything. Um, and I meant to show you guys this earlier. I have 4G LTE at Musco Lounge Lake State Park where we never have internet. Yeah, or service. Or service. <laughs> I'm never able to do anything yeah, we're here. we're only allowed service at the guardhouse. Yeah, there's Wi-Fi at the guardhouse and that's yep. it. Yep. And we have 4G. Wow. Yeah, not just 4G, 4G LTE. Holy wow. cow. So if you're looking to get something for your camper, your RV, your house, whatever, I highly suggest WeBoost because it, it does actually work. What are you doing? <laughs> this is you want it over there. She's like, I'm trying to get over to this bed because this window's open and I want to see outside. Mm. Yeah, be careful because that window's open and she wants to see outside. <laughs> she can hear them over there. See, like, my friends are over there and it's, I can hear them. It's Greg. See? Yeah, it's just Greg. <laughs> Shelby's like, wait, what? It's Greg? Right here. See right here. Oh. So yeah, and I'd like to say thanks again to WeBoost for sending this to us because I can actually get some stuff done, maybe even upload some Instagram photos while we're here, which is pretty cool. I've never been able to do that from this park. So that's exciting. Hey, Shelby, your tongue is sticking out and it's actually sticking out quite a ways. I didn't mean to wake you up when I turned the lights on. <laughs> your, uh, your tongue right there? Yeah, you got it, good job. So tonight is actually Matt's first night camping. They're out there setting up a tent. It's like 12.30. Memphis has decided she's taking over this bed. We're gonna go ahead and call it a night and just get ready for bed and go to sleep. So, we hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Hopefully tomorrow will be drone rescue video. <laughs> and uh, yeah, oh, thanks for watching you guys. As always, stay positive, dream big, and we will see you again soon. Good night, partyans. Memphis, I just want to snuggle you to bits. I want to snuggle you to bits, too. You're both so dang cute. If you love our huskies, come along for the ride. All you have to do is hit subscribe. Follow as we share our lives with our dogs and join our adventures on Snow Dog Vlogs.